You've described light as a drug. What is going on there? Like, that's like a clickbait title. So like, fill me in on that. Yeah, that's one of my, my favorite little coinages. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. Light is literally a drug. So light, as folks probably have heard, is both a wave and a particle. Don't think about it too much right now. But the duality paradox of light, it comes to us in little particles called photons, and they literally travel through the eye to the tissue on the back of the eye, which is, believe it or not, the, uh, an outpost of brain tissue. So if you wanted to map out, like, where's the brain? The furthest outpost of the brain is the back of the eye. We call it the retina. And it's literally made just like the rest of brain tissue, except it's in the back of our eyeball. So like a re the retina, like if you took my eyeball away, the thing that's left, it's basically part of my brain rather than part of my eye. Or am I just like opening up like a th something <laughs> that professors argue about endlessly? <laughs> yeah, yeah. So, it, okay. So neuroscientists would say that the back of the eye. So if, if, if somebody's eyeball is removed, wow, this is really taking a dark turn right at the outset. No, no pun intended. Dark turn, eyeball, I don't know. It's like dad jokes just <laughs> roll out unintentionally. The back of the eyeball is, if you talk to a neuroscientist, they'd say that looks just like brain tissue, the retina. And so neuroscientists would say, that the optic nerve, which travels from what we classically think of as the brain to the back of the eye, that the optic nerve ends in the retina. And the whole thing is really technically, to a neuroscientist, still part of brain tissue. So what's the point? When those little packets of light hit the back of the eye, they're really hitting the brain. And they are lodging into specialized receptors. So when we think of a brain chemical like dopamine or serotonin, we think, well, if we know anything at all about neuroscientists, uh, neuroscience, we know that serotonin has specialized receptors between brain cells. They're called serotonin receptors. We have dopamine. We've talked about D2 receptors for dopamine and so forth. Well, there are photon receptors. Photon is like a drug, like a neurochemical that hits these specialized receptors in the back of the eye and they are not the rods and the cones that we learned about maybe back in school that give us color vision and give us black and white vision. These are basically just picking up the luminance, the intensity of light. And they signal with this broadband connection back to the center of the brain where the body clock is. For people keeping score at home, it's called the suprachiasmic nucleus. 